Now, Director General of the World Health Organization, Dr. Tedros Ghebreyesus, says his organization has verified 18 attacks on health facilities, health workers, and ambulances, including 10 deaths and 16 injuries in Ukraine. He stressed that these attacks have deprived whole communities of health care. At a press conference in Geneva, Dr. Tedros said WHO has delivered 18 metric tons of supplies to address the health crisis, adding that the organization is establishing a pipeline of supplies for health facilities throughout Ukraine, especially in the most affected areas. His father says the organization delivered five metric tons of medical supplies to Kyiv on Tuesday to support surgical care for 150 trauma patients and other supplies to manage a range of health conditions for, uh, for 45,000 people for a month. So far, WHO has verified 18 attacks on health facilities, health workers, and ambulances, including 10 deaths and 16 injuries. These attacks deprive whole communities of health care. More than 2 million people have left Ukraine, and WHO is supporting neighboring countries to provide health care for refugees, most of whom are women and children. Part of a, a radiation and medicine, medicine emergency response network, which is led by IEEA under the leadership of Dr. Janet Carr here at, uh, at WHO. Uh, clearly, we have raised the issue of chemical and bioradionuclear um, safety right since the beginning of this pandemic.